Today I'm going to show you how to create a report using Report Designer that has a chart in which you could drill down on the category levels. So in order to do this, um, what I'm going to do is build a chart that shows the different sales by order status type and then we're going to be able to drill down on each of those bars that represent the order status type. Now we already have a report that's pre-built in the user console that shows detailed information on order status. So we're going to drill, we want to drill down to this report. And here you notice that this report has order status as a parameter. So what we want to do is we want to pass that to this report. So let's go ahead and do that. Um, first what we're going to do is create our JDBC connection to our sample data. And here is the SQL I have. Um, it is documented on my blog at arubawayne.com. Um, also on the Pentaho Sandbox, sandbox.pentaho.com. Um, here you'll notice that um, I'm just pulling back the order status types, and I am I am um, limiting the data to exclude shipped. Um, so I'm going to go ahead and click OK. Or we can preview the data so you can see what that looks like. Click OK. And so now what you want to do is drag a chart object onto the report header. So I'm going to go in here into the report header. Our column is going to be status. Our, uh, our category is going to be status. Our value is going to be sales. And then now to add the drill linking to it, we simply go down to the values attributes. And we expand on this drill link formula. I've already have it created, but I'll show you how we can how you can do it. To make things easier, you can select user defined here under the categories. And then I'm going to expand this so we have more room. You want to go, go ahead and log into the repository. It'll automatically put your URL here. And then you can browse to that particular report. That's the report that we saw within the user console that's already built, order status. And then you'll notice that order status has a parameter called O status. And what we're going to do is tie that to the chart category key. That category key is the representation of each of those bars. So one for on hold, one for shipped, one for canceled, so on and so forth. And then you'll notice that it builds this formula for you automatically by filling all this in. So I'm just going to go ahead and click OK and click OK again. And then now we, our report's ready to be tested. So all I have to do is preview this in HTML mode, and then I can go ahead and click through this chart. So for example, let's say I want to take a look at all the in-process um, st status, statuses. So I see in-process is selected, in-process here, as well as all the in-process orders. Again, that is how you would do drill linking within using Report Designer and a chart. For more information, please see sandbox.pentaho.com.